it is very difficult to change my language when I'm speaking Tlingit, uh, but I'd like you to welcome Akun Matu tonight, and she is a well-known artist and a performer. And will you welcome Akum Matu? Yewa, gonna cheese, yewa. because it's been in my life this whole time. And it, it feels like coming out of like this dark, deep place. And I'm not doing any of my material that everybody knows. I'm doing all brand material right now. That's why I need you close. That's why I need you near me. Because I can't do it without you. I just want to thank you. I want to thank the Clinket Nation and the Haida Nation and the, Akwa, the, the land that we're on. I was a young teen here. I was inspired to be this from here, from this stage. trying to beat you down with my ideas and my faith and my spirituality but I can't hold it in outside inside anymore oh, oh, oh. all of you showed up. Thank you. You know, I gotta just say just right out, I'm a Christian. And that's the most unpopular thing in the world to be right now. It really is. It'd be better if I came out as something else like a tomato. I'm a tomato, everyone. I'm a tomato. But I'm not a tomato. I'm a, I believe in Jesus, I believe in God, and I was raised with that. And it's, I'm not trying to push it on you, and I'm gonna go through this complicated, messed up history that we've had with the missionaries, and they were wrong. They were so wrong. And they did so much damage. But they are not the Bible. And they're not the truth. And I know this is a wild thing to be, but I'm a Christian rapper now, and you're watching my debut. Oh, come with a journey on me, with me. Don't be, just try to let go of your preconceptions. I know you have so many, and I know, I know it's hard. 
and it's okay if you want to just leave but I'm I'm actually this is just level two this is level two so if you you can't leave you can't leave if this is level two and it's only a half an hour so I just ask you to just sit with me a while and let's see if we can go to ten searching and seeking I searched too I mean I did I searched Hinduism and Buddha I researched everything I used to be a Vedic astrologer I mean I did every single thing I mean I did every single thing but the Bible everything I mean all the way I hope you know that and let's go any teens in the house I made a song just for you I was a teen here in Juneau hey K do you understand like back in the day in the 90s I was running around this way for eight years I lived here in Yo, Juneau here we go again. I know it is hard trying to figure out what you're doing yes I know why I went through it, I didn't know too what to do, what to do, what road to go through. I feel you. I was with you last night, and I know that you're pain, and I can see your light burning bright. Do you understand? Yes, or you? I was right there with you, seeing someone true. Now it's reversed, do you know? Reaching back to the time destiny, yo. Now I'm on the stage that inspired me in the same hall. Yes, do you? full circle I just want to encourage you whatever dreams you have it doesn't have to be a rapper it doesn't have Yo, to be something go, big and yeah. fantastic just go for what mine go for what mine just go for what mine understand just go for what mine open up your heart open up your brain yes you can yes you can do it I believe in you I put all of my Your pain, so much this degradation. Yes, I know. I was there too, as all of these, yeah. When I don't mean to ignore you, but those are my audience in the back, those two. Young and I, 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 young and talk about that complicated history with God. Breaks my heart. I'll talk about it from KKK. One perspective like back in the day. Do you know? I call it represent rapid colonization, yo. It came and happened so, so fast. It's still happening. It's like a big blast. Just boom, 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 boom. And things are new, 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 new. Who knew? talking about it today about all the things that they did take away and it's easy to tie those things into things like the Bible and Christianity and I'm not saying I'm a religious person I'm just saying that there's truth there and God is real I've been unpacking this from an elder way talking to my elders who know the back in the day who know the long time ago ways I talked to an elder it was so cool hey he was like we already knew we already knew God it's true and it was a tonic and the devil was to nothing and you know what a cook was a shaman I hate that word a disciple 
a disciple of either one, a disciple of the good or the bad. Do you understand? We already had our knowledge and our place. We already knew God and we knew his sweet, sweet face. So it wasn't anything new. Actually, my own elders, it was prophesied to that the missionaries would come and the thing that they would bring would be a book. We saw it in our dreams. All of our ancestors foretold what was going to be. And we knew that Jesus was coming too. We saw it in our dreams, so it must be true. Oh, I know they took so many things away. Oh, oh, I know they punished you so hard that day. Ancestral memories embedded in your DNA. So many things going lighting up in your skin, hey. It's like you have a reflex automatic. I understand it. It was true, the things that they did do. I mean, they put my aunt in a trash can. Cause she was speaking her language, man. Oh. And they beat us down in the way that they divided the Alaska with all those different denominations that was so wrong. They did so many wrong things. But we knew that that was coming. We knew the good was coming. Do you know? I have a friend. He's an 86-year-old Baptist man. He's from the South and he's so funny. He makes me laugh. Yes, I just gotta say I went through the Bible with him every single thing and he was like, of course you knew God. Of course your dances and your language and your everything is of God. Of course it's right here in the Bible. And I don't know why I need an 86 year old white man to tell me that. That's really messed up. But he said it. I know what they did was wrong. But don't let that keep you in bondage. There's light on the other side. Do you want? Oh. Thank you. These heels are really intense. I'm a kumatu, I'm really intense, but I love you. And if you see me in the normal life, I'll be like, oh, hi, you know, really sweet. So, so I mean, it's like a been a journey for me. And my great grandfather was actually my mom and my uncle, so I know it's awkward to to transform into this. <laughs> but we love you. Welcome to Hawaii. We can do this. Um, it's okay. Everybody will be okay. I'm not for everyone. I won't be for everyone. It's, there is a niche, niche market of, of Christian rappers. I had no idea. These are actual songs from the Bible. I cannot memorize. He that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord, He is my refuge and my fortress. My God, in Him will I trust. Surely He shall deliver thee from the snare of the fowler and from the noise of pestilence. He shall cover thee with His feathers, and under His wings shall thou trust. His truth shall be thy shield and buckler. Thou shalt not be afraid of the terror by night, nor for the arrows that flyeth by day, nor for the pestilence that walketh in darkness, nor for the es no for the disease, nor for the destruction that wasted at noonday. A thousand shall fall at thy side and ten thousand at thy right hand, yet it shall not come nigh thee, for only with thine eyes shall thou see the reward of the wicked. I will say of the Lord, he is my refuge and my fortress, my God. In him will I trust, surely he shall deliver thee. It's kind of hard to. <laughs> surely he shall deliver thee. Surely he 
you should look at I see, that's why I brought my Bible up here. Thank you, everyone. Okay, we're getting there. From the snare of the fella. Okay, here, I remember. Because thou hast made the Lord, which is my refuge, even the most high, thy habitation, there shall no evil befall thee, neither shall any plague come nigh thy dwelling, for he shall give his angels charge over thee, and keep thee in all thy ways, whether there lest, lest thy dash thy foot against a stone. Thou shalt tread upon the lion and the adder, the young lion and the dragon shall thou trample under feet, because he hath put his love upon me. Therefore will I deliver him. I will set him up high, because he hath known my name. He will call upon me, and I will answer him. I will be with him in, in trouble. I will deliver him and honor him. With long life shall with long life shall I. Uh, <laughs> with long life shall I find, oh my goodness, with long life shall I find, uh, I'll have to say a word here that's not from the Bible, and show him my salvation. Okay, there we go. He that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. He that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. Okay, I know it's different. It's okay. Here's a couple more songs. I only have three memorized. This is the one that helped me through my mom's passing. I will extol thee, O Lord, for thou hast lifted me up and has not made my foes to rejoice over me. O oh Lord my God, I cried unto thee, and thou hast healed me. O oh Lord, thou hast brought up my soul from the grave. Thou hast kept me alive, that I should not go down into the pit. Sing unto the Lord, all ye saints of hills, and give thanks at the remembrance of his holiness. Sing unto the Lord, all ye saints of his, and give thanks at the remembrance his holiness for his anger endureth but a moment in his favor is life weeping may endure for a night but joy cometh in the morning and in my prosperity I said I shall never be moved isn't that beautiful sounds like rap right <laughs> I know, right? Lord, in my prosperity, I said, I shall never be moved. Lord, by thy favor, thou hast made my mountain to stand strong. Thou didst hide thy face, and I was troubled. I cried unto thee, and then unto the Lord I made supplication. What profit is there in my blood when I go down into the pit? Shall the dust sing praise to thee? Shall it declare thy truth? Hear, O oh Lord, have mercy upon me. Lord, be thou my helper, for thou hast turned my mourning into dancing. Thou hast put off my sackcloth and girded me with gladness in to the end that my glory may give praise to thee and not be silent. To the end that my glory may give praise to thee and not be silent. Okay, it's been, I'll, I'll do one just for the ladies. That has no Christian things in it, but you've heard a lot. Oh. These, you know, I've been through abusive relationships. 
mentally, almost physically. I was somebody's secret for years. Now I'm single, I'm celibate, I'm... Next person who gets me will be my husband, all right? Let's say that, all right? And he'll have to wait for that, too. I'm not, I'm not playing anymore. But I see some ladies in here that I know, and you've gone through it, too. And I just want to give you love and encouragement. I got to rewind the beat. Otherwise, it's going to run out. <laughs> You're better than that. You're worth more than that, girl. You don't need that. All the mind games he plays and gets into your blood, into your skin, telling you things like you're not worth it. You'll never be. What are you wearing that for? Why did you see that person? Why did you go that way? I mean, why are you even looking at me that way? I mean, all the things that they say, even backstage when they're talking about my body. I mean, I'm just tired of it all. Treat me with some respect. Would you want your great granddaughter to be talking to like that? No, I don't think so. I'm a professional. Treat me like it, yo. I'm just saying. I'm tired of the games. I have my own power and I know my own pain. And, uh, I know my sisters, some of them are still going through it. Oh yes, do you see? I've been there too. I've been there right there with you. I almost was killed a few times, you see. And I was the R word so many times, too many times. I know it's not safe so many times to be in the place and I know as a native woman I'm always on the lookout and even when I'm safe something tends to even happen that really messes with me man even now and I just want to uplift all our, our, our sisters and say you're better than that you deserve more than that you're better than that no oh. You're better than that. Stand up for yourself. You're better than that. Oh, you're better than that. Don't take it confronted in the moment. You're better than that. No, girl. I mean, I love you, girl. And I know you. And I don't understand why you go through what he's been putting you through. All of those games. I mean, he doesn't even have his own house. Barely has a car. He's living off you, man off you and he just he asks you to pay I mean I was the one that paid I was the sugar mama made me feel like I was special just to be around him like I was lucky I mean I went through two narcissists in a row it almost killed me in every single way yo and I knew when I rose and I knew that I can grow and say no and no again and no no than that don't talk to me like that doesn't work with me don't even look at me right here keep your eyes up tired of that seriously and I just love you he should have a house a car a job he should have something to provide you not be living off of you not be making you to feel like you're nothing Less than nothing. You're better than that, yo. Please know. You're better than that, ho. Oh. What would your great, 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 great grandmother do in that situation? What would your great, 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 great grandfather do if he did that to you? Think about it like that. When I look into the mirror, I see my great, 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 great grandfather in me, my great grandmother in me. I got my lips tattooed just like she does. 
and I think about what would she do in the situation that makes her feel yucky and all gross again. I mean, no, just stop that now, cause she wouldn't put up with it. Oh, you're better than that girl. You're a queen of your people. You're a princess, you are needed. We need you to rise up to your strength. Trust me, they'll rise to you. You should be having a contest of them fighting over you. A whole contest, and maybe the best one might win, but if they don't, if you don't like them, just stop it, and maybe in a year you'll have another contest again. That's what I've been thinking about. They should be fighting for the chance to even look at me, or even have a moment of my time. Not be saying jokes around me, getting undressed. No, it's not funny. You're better than that girl. You're better than that. You're a queen, you're a princess of your people. Claim your power, claim your ancestry. Yes, you'll see. They'll be clamoring for you and you could say no. No, 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 no. I wonder how many minutes I have left. I have literally two hours of material, so it's four minutes, just enough. Asses. Asses. This is my goodbye song. Thank you for helping me transition into my... I'm going through some things, yes. It's a big thing. And it's all right. It's all right. If you have questions about my faith, you can come to me. I'm not going to pamphlet you to and cover you with a whole thing of pamphlets. And, you know, I'm obviously here for you if you want to talk to me. I will be the most sweetest, softest, understanding, not trying to, a respectful person, okay? So, no pressure. I wasn't gonna do any new old songs tonight, but I could. Okay, she wants me to do a, a song that I did last night. I don't know if I can, I don't know if I can, but you heard it last night. A lot of these people, I, I had a, a, an agreement with my higher self that I'm not gonna do any old songs tonight. Well, it's been so good to see you. Everybody feeling Nakamatu. Tell me you love Akumatu. Tell me you love say Akumatu. Akumatu. You too. Yes, I love you too. Thank you for coming and see what I do do. It's in the transition. Yes, I know. And I gotta thank all of you for coming out here, yo. To Aurora Catherine. And to oh am I forgetting it? It's new, it's new for me. And to you, uh, to Alu. Everyone, I can't see. I can't see you, but I know. I, I know Marie Mead is here, and that really means a lot to me. She's really an amazing musician in her own right, and it's such an honor to have such a respected elder here. It means a lot to me. Thank you. Thank you to Kachung for all that you do. Thank you to Akrak for having me to the land of the Ark. Did I say it right? Yes, you know. Thank you to the clinking and hide I'm adopted to yo. Do you understand? Hey, I just wanna say we're here for some fun. Let's start it off. Hey, hey. I know it's raining outside, but you're gonna be alright. Akuma 2 is here for you for the next three days. I'll be giving all my love from another stage at Friday at 5.30. Short plug with all the rappers doing freestyle cyphers. Oh, I love you, I love you, I love you. And I'm sorry I can't be everyone's friend. 
some friendships have to end. And that's just how it goes. But I can, so I'm very, very private now. But there are people that I really, really, really love. And that's enough, that's enough for me. <laughs> and one at a time, everybody. Oh, awesome. thank you. I know that you will do amazing things to remember to respect that fire in you follow your dreams every one of you let it come up from the seams remember your true calling while you're here let it blow higher higher yes dear follow your passions follow your light even though it doesn't make I'm Akuma too. I love you guys. Akuma too, everybody.